All right, here with uh, Brianna Bay after Stetson's 70-68 win in overtime. And Bay, tell me what it was like to play in a game like this today. I mean, it was tough, but I kind of was excited that when we go overtime, it's a chance to show coach what we really made of. So down the stretch, I was just ready to play. Like, I wasn't nervous. I was just ready to when help the team. On, when you're on the court in a pressure situation, final sight, I mean, what do you hold on to to not get nervous? Um, I'm just with my team. I know they got my back and I got theirs. So just seeing them next to me in the same situation and going together as the, just being together. So. You know, yesterday it was, you were in foul trouble and Sarah kind of had your back a little bit. Today it was reversed. She was the one in foul trouble. You step up with 23 points. Um, I mean, it just seems to be the way the team goes. Somebody's always there to pick someone else up. Yeah, um, I ain't know Sarah got in foul trouble. Like, I didn't know until she got her last foul that, on. yeah, I ain't know. So I was like, oh, man, I'm like, why wow, this keep happening to us? So uh -huh. I knew I had to watch my foul, so that's what I was trying to do, just watching. Several of your teammates hit some big shots. Uh, Brittany Chambers had one late in regulation. Uh, Rianti Saunders comes back in and hits one in overtime. Can you talk about either of those plays? Yeah, um, well, that's just like we'll be doing practice. Like last minute situations, we come, we do that in practice. And Coach Bria just rolled down a play for me and Britt, and Britt just hit the big shot, so it went in. Absolutely. So that was and good. how does it feel to be six and one on the season right now? Feels great. All right, thanks, Bay. Thank you.